So all along the bald, coming up to the bald, there are azaleas everywhere. There's also lots of these mountain laurels, also known as calmia. Really starting to get some good blooms in here with these pinks right now. Some really nice oranges everywhere right now, and oranges and yellows and reds with the native flame azalea. So we're getting all types of colors through here. And of course, Weston keeps spotting variegated plants. So we're seeing a little bit of everything here. And uh, this is definitely a fun hike. You should definitely try it out and come check this out during the Azalea Festival here in Robbins. This Hooper Bald area as being such a cool plant to, place to come see these plants, see this diversity. And when you're seeing these tags, we know we're on the right trail. We know we're following where the experts have followed down this trail and spotted these plants and tagged them. So it's really cool to be behind these pioneers in a native azaleas and sort of just walking their exact same path, coming right down the path and seeing this cool plant. Guys, we just walked through a rhododendron thicket and then we stumbled upon this beauty. I mean, this is a peach colored rhododendron calendulacean. I mean, really peach. I haven't seen anything else quite like this yet. This is the perfect color of peach that really just stands out. I mean, we're gonna have to go up close to this thing. This thing is killer awesome, uh, super amazing. You probably keep hearing me say that, but I really am geeking out that hard. I hope you are too. This one has huge blooms. The blooms curve together to almost form a much bigger, larger truss. But the thing that's really unique about this is this orange-red calendacean has a really large orange blotch, probably the largest blotch I've seen out here. And it just makes something really special with that, the way this cups backward. The Hooper's bald azaleas, they're amazing. Hey guys, thanks for checking out part two of the Hooper Bald Azalea Adventure. Uh, it's been absolutely amazing. We've seen all kinds of calendulaceum. Uh, it's been awesome. So if you've enjoyed the part two, you got to make sure you go back and watch the part one. So thanks for watching, you guys.